right, I've got an upgrade for my Unraid server. I've been given a few old, not that old, 4 gigabyte SAS drives and I managed to get hold of a set of cables that allow me to plug it into my SAS controller but also power it with uh, SATA power because I don't have a um, SAS backplane and then I've had to buy this case to put it in my machine because I don't have space for another five hard drives. The case was pretty cheap actually, it was like 20 quid off eBay and I put a be quiet fan in the front there which should be uh, good enough to cool them down a bit, hope so anyway. Might have to keep an eye on that, we'll see. And just to make the uh, power distribution a bit easier, I've got these splitters on it, which allow me to power two drives off one connector, which should be okay. And also, the, these are pretty close to each other, so it makes it a bit easier to actually get the cables going. So they're um, Seagate Enterprise Plus drives. Uh, they are used. They have been in a data center, actually. So... Um, I have to keep an eye on how much life's left in them, but it should be okay. Um, yeah, so I'm just upgrading my Unraid now actually to the new version. And then I'm gonna set these up, gonna add two to my existing Unraid array to expand the capacity of that. And then I'm gonna set up another two as a pool, a separate pool, which I will use for database storage and then I'm actually just going to keep one as a spare, so that's not going to be plugged in. Just be sat in the machine, and I can use it as a spare in case one of them fails, which uh, I hope it doesn't. And I've got a few more of these um, that I'll be able to use for other projects, but I don't think they'll fit in my case. Yeah, so that was a quick video. I'll uh, see how I get on.